Golf Emergency Services, this is Cicely. How may I help you? Hello? My son is choking. Please send someone. And your name? Danielle. Danielle, honey, I can't understand you when you're so shrill. I don't know what to do. Danielle, it seems that you are not at the appropriate emotional and conversational level for us to send aid. He's not breathing. Please. If you would be so kind to respond to me in a calmer manner, I would love to assist you. Baby, come on. Please. Please hold while I connect you to our automated calming services. Hello. In order for us to assist you properly, please relax to a civilized manner. Anything less than your best is disadvantageous to an unblemished society. Please follow along. Breathe in. Five, four, three, two. Good evening, everyone. It's nice to see all of your lovely faces once again. Seven days left in this season's call competition. I know that Gabriel is still leading the pack, but it's still anyone's game. If you need motivation, just think of that big, juicy bonus on your desk first thing Monday morning. And, of course, being the face of the company for a year, although I'm sure we'll all miss seeing Gabriel's pearly whites on the commute every day. <laughs> Keep up the great work, and remember, we, we are the bridge from hysteria to peace. He's something, isn't he? I just don't know how he does it. We used to date. Used to? Yep. Dating him was... <laughs> but I'll tell you what, I did learn some tricks of the trade. Oh, but it won't do me any good now. I'm transferring next month. Oh, congrats. Thank you. You know, I would love to see someone dethrone him before I leave. Do you, uh, recycle? Of course. Good. <laughs> then you'll have a clean conscience doing this. Throw away your book. But how will I know if someone needs to be redirected? If they're reacting violently, they already have a predisposition to be negative. It's better to focus your efforts on those who aren't susceptible to those kinds of emotions. But I thought calming services was a last resort for those who refuse to be civil for the greater good. If less of them existed, the world would be a more peaceful place. That's how Gabe looks at it anyway. What do do? Every single Friday, straight to Eddie's place. <laughs> Golf Emergency Services, this is Cicely. How may I help you? I need help. Please. Please send someone quick.
Golf Emergency Services, this is Cicely. How may I help you? My name is Philly. Oh my god, hi! It's so funny that we're running into each other. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually uh, just coming from Eddie's. I don't know if you've been there. I've been going there for years. What? I thought it was the only one. It's such a hole-in-the-wall kind of place. I know! You know, <laughs> I just got your call stats in this morning. You may need a little preparatory information if you become the face of the company. How about dinner this Sunday? I would love to, yeah. Fantastic. <laughs> 7 o'clock, meet you here. I look forward to it. All right, I'll let you get back to it. Keep up the good work. See you Sunday.
Sicily. I know it looks bad, but it's not. There was an accident, and I, I didn't want to miss our meeting. Neither Goff nor I supports those who disrespect the societal standards. But, but I do. There, there was a fire, and, um... But I, I, once I get the bonus, I, I can... I think it's best you leave before you cause a public scene. probably call for help. Got emergency services, this is Gabriel. How may I help you? There's someone in my house. And what is your name, sweetie? He's got a gun. Please send someone. This is Cicely. I work there. Cicely, you are not at the appropriate emotional and conversational level for us to send aid. He's saying he's gonna kill me. Help me, please, please. Please hold while I connect you to our automated calming services. Hello. In order for us to assist you properly, please relax in a civilized manner. Anything less than your bed. Do you know the people surrounding you? No. No. That's not true. You're lying. You do know these people. This is Gordon. I called you last week. Armed robbery. Didn't make it. This is Lindsay. Car wreck. Also didn't make it. My wife called you six months ago. Her son was choking on his dinner. He didn't make it. Tell me, do you value your life more than these people? Careful. They're listening. Ignorance is a choice. <laughs> 